Hey guys, it's me, Vian Chalon here, and, uh, yeah, and I haven't been on YouTube for, like, I don't know, a year or so, so, yeah, let's just get straight into it, so as you can see right here, I have the terminal open, so um, today I'm gonna be, guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to install QEMU on a ARM or x86 Chromebook. So first you need Linux beta support turned on, so you have to go to settings. And you want to go to Linux beta. And then there's going to be turn on button for you here. A turn on button. Yeah, you want to click on that. And then uh, follow the instructions on screen and then I'll start installing Linux beta. This is the settings right here. Right here. So, yeah, close that. Now what you want to do is you want to go to the search and you want to type in terminal. And then you'll see this window pop up now what you want to do here is have an l s l sorry l s c p u enter now you want to pay attention to this architecture thing this is very important because this little architecture thing if it says x86 underscore 64 you have an x86 chromebook if it says anything, if it says something else, then you're gonna, you're probably gonna have an ARM Chromebook right here, right here. So, sorry, it's having clear, I'm better use to install. So, what you want to do is you want to type in, you want to type in sudo apt dash get install qemu dash system qemu dash utils. Hit enter. I already downloaded it, so you know. So then, into clear. Then, if you do, if I do qemu dash system dash x eighty six, so you see it has x eighty six underscore sixty four. And if we do qemu dash system, it have all these stuff come up. If I just do qemu, a lot more stuff will come up got all of this more you might be thinking why is there so much more than this because there's a qemu dash img comes with it as well there's some dash static there's way more stuff right so yeah you can do lot of stuff with this and then you can play around so if you want proof that this actually works i'm gonna launch x86 64 with no arguments because i'm not going to install a program i'm not install it sorry i know what's on this thing so when you hit enter, it should uh, start, it's just that it'll take some time to start. And then there we go, just like that. Now since it didn't do any uh, argument, so it'll just boot from whatever it can find. So yeah. Yeah, so I'll see you guys later in the next video, bye.